is Jennifer from OpenFrame and today I'm going to walk you through how to create a virtual tour. So the first thing you're going to do is press on the plus button, then click on virtual tour, and on the screen you'll see prompts that will help guide you on what to do next. So the first thing you're going to want to do is go to the first room, it's usually the entryway, and you're going to take your very first picture there. The timer, you can set the timer to three seconds or five seconds to give yourself enough time to leave the room. Once the picture is taken, you're going to label it and click next. And then you're going to walk to where uh, the next room is, so the next entry or doorway, you'll walk to it, you'll click on add room, then you're going to uh, walk on over, move your tripod, and set the tripod down in that doorway, or in the middle, middle of the next room set it down and then you're going to take your next picture. Again your timer, your timer will be automatically set to what it was in the previous room so if you need more time you can feel free to adjust that in the upper right hand corner. And after your picture is taken you're going to label that room and click next. And then you'll see a prompt asking you to mark where you just came from. So you're going to use your finger to scroll on the screen to point to the other doorway, press and hold, and then it'll, a little uh, pink circle will appear. Then it'll ask you where you're going next, and you'll move, this, move your finger on the screen to scroll and tap and hold your finger to that next spot. And then again, you're gonna go take your next picture, just as you did before. And again, label your room. And again, you'll see the prompt asking you where you just came from, so you're going to move your finger on the screen to point to that direction, press and hold, and then you, again, you're going to go to where you want to go next, press and hold, and then add a room. So you can do this as many times as you'd like, as many rooms as you have, and uh, keep taking that picture. You're going to, again, go from where you point to where you were coming from, and then point to where you are going next. So this is the last room that we're going to take. We're just going to do three rooms just for the sake of keeping this uh, quick and easy. Uh, but after you label this last room, again, you're going to show where you just came from. And then you're going to click on Save. And then you're going to click on Done in the upper right hand corner. And then you can click Next. Here you can basically, if you want to just take a look at, I'm just going to scroll around, show you how it works. It's leading you from one room, one room to the next, allowing you to scroll, see the entire room, and click to lead you to the next room. And then you're done. So here, you can uh, after you click next, you can label the property. So you can add the number of bedrooms, bathrooms, the type of property, any additional information. Um, and then you're done. So it'll take you to this page where you can actually create a web page for this virtual tour. Uh, and it really only takes a couple of seconds. So uh, the more rooms you have, it'll take a little bit longer, but really under under you know 60 seconds is what it should, what, what it should take. Um, and here you can actually see a preview of what the video will look like. It'll give you a URL that you can easily copy and share uh, directly from our app by text or email or even share on Facebook. But this is your own property page with a unique URL uh, that you can share and then you can click right there on the screen um, and use those pink hotspots to take you from one room to the next and guide you through the property. Thanks for watching our video. I, f I hope you found it helpful. Please feel free to reach out to us if you have any questions at all. Uh, you can reach us at contact at getopenframe.com. And just wanted to note also that hopefully you'll do a better job at hiding uh, when you're taking your virtual tours. Obviously, we're here in our office. Um, so when you're taking your virtual tour, once you click on the button to take your picture, you're going to want to get out of the frame so that you're not visible. Um, but other than that, enjoy.